Hello everybody, welcome to Undertale Part 13. I'm your host, the one only Dig. Well, I just logged my save file, guys, and this is where it dumped me off, so I'm assuming we go back and do a flowery set and talk to Alphys? Cause I guess this does make sense of what they said, that you cannot get the pacifist ending before you get a neutral ending. Or whatever it is. I don't know. This is blind, guys, don't forget that. I didn't look anything up about the endings. As much as I wanted to, to be prepared, I couldn't do that because that would not make it a blind run then. <laughs> is this the quickest way back, too? I have no idea. Where does Elway take us again? Right, take us back here. And then we use this elevator. I mean, I just played through this. I shouldn't know where everything is still. But I don't. Oh, now we're back here at the core. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. So from the core, we can head back to Alfie's lab, I guess. I have no idea if this is how I get the true pacifist ending either. Okay, this door is open again, this pathway. Also, do I need more health items? I have no idea. Oh, ring? Hey, uh, this is Undyne. Shut up, Papyrus. This was your idea. Human, you have to deliver something for me. What? Uh, please? I'm at Snowden in front of Papyruses. See ya, punk. Quick. Oh, it's so I had to... I don't know, guys. I just don't know anymore. Okay, so does this elevator work now? No, so I could never get to the capital, huh? It's kind of... Where do I sell? Sell... Alright. Alright, down here. Down here? No, 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 no. I assume this is the quickest way back to Alfie's lamp, right? But it was left three. I like to say left three. I can't remember this shit. No, this is where the spiders are. God damn it! It's left two, I think. So, in regards to that final encounter with Flowey, I was not expecting that in the slightest. No, but this isn't right either. It has to be left for one. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Because that was not pixelated. It was like real. I don't know how to describe that graphic design, but it was freaky as hell. Once my glasses aren't staying on. Okay, we're back here. Okay, let's see if Alfie's is here now. And if not, then we'll go. There's no response. Oh, so I guess we have to go to snow then. Tra la la. Care for a ride? Riding the boat, yes. Well, oh, first I want to go waterfall. I want to talk to that turtle person again. If that no turtle, not person, turtle. When he said come back later, I might have remembered why we call him something. I'm having a little concert. Uh, good for you, river person. <laughs> Fairy person. Come again sometime. Tra la la. Yeah, this turtle right in here. No, no, uh, b -b -b talk. Oh, he still doesn't remember it. Damn it. I tried, guys. Yeah, so now we're gonna go with Snow then. Snow then. So could I have gotten the pacifist ending if I just walked back and gotten the phone call from Undyne? Is that how you get the pacifist ending? I have no idea. 
I should have worn a few more pairs of pants today. Did you say that to me already? <laughs> I'm getting some time. Try la la. I also wonder if I, if I speak to the Snow Drake. Can I talk to him about his father or not? Ooh, it's tempting to go back, but I don't think it, it would do anything. Because I imagine there's a lot of secret hidden stuff you can do in this game, too, but. Uh, that's it. I'll wait. Um, so I have a favor to ask you. Uh, I, I need you to deliver this letter to Dr. Alfie's. Huh? Why don't I do it myself? Um, well. It's kind of personal, but we're friends, so... I'll have to tell you. Hotland sucks. I don't want to have to go over there. That is true. So here you go. You got the un... Why is the, the Undyne's Letter? Should it be Undyne's Letter? <clears throat> oh, and if you read it, I'll kill you. Thanks so much. You're the best. I better not read that, then. Undyne writes a lot of letters, but she can never seem to find the right words. So when she goes to deliver them herself... She always quits so she can go back and rewrite. That's why she asked you. Because you have those standards. Thanks. So yeah, guys, I've watched some art people play through this game up to the points where I have played it. Uh, it surprised me so much to see that nobody... A of the four people i watched so far, none of them actually went into this room where the dog is. You got a lot of trophies for doing that, giving donations to the box, but it takes us so much damn time, because you, you can only donate one coin at a time. You gotta donate over, like, 400 gold or something. That we're still alive. How do I get into that room? I know there's a way to get in there. I mean, it just surprises me how they see this passageway under the sink and they don't bother to investigate it. <laughs> That's the first thing I did. Right, so we gotta head back to the ferry person. I just realized, is the lab going to be open now? I have no idea if the lab's going to be open now. Hotland. Then we're off. Of course, if that is what you have to do to get the pacifist ending, that does make sense, because I never would have thought to go back and get a phone call from Undyne. The piano plays the tinkling song. Hmm, tinkling. A very unusual word. I'm gonna try. Yes, 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 yes. So is the lab door open now? Let's see. The mail slot. Sorry, the letter under. Slide. Or give it a knock. Uh, oh no! Is that in there a letter? I don't want to open it. Can't I just slide it back out? No, you cannot. <laughs> No, I can't keep doing this. I'll read this one. What? Um, it shut kind of strongly, isn't it? Wait a second. What the hell was that? Hey, if this is a joke, it's... Oh, you better not take the letters from me, though. Oh my god. Did you write this letter? It wasn't signed, so I had no idea who could have... Oh my god, oh no. That's adorable. And I, I had no idea you, um, wrote that. No, it, it's not for me. It's surprising, too, after all the gross stuff I... What? I don't really deserve to be forgiven. Did you really, like, sabotage the systems just so you could be the hero, like Metan said? Much less, um, this. And so passionately, too. You know what? Okay, I'll do it. It's the least I could do to make it up to you. Yeah, let's go on a... Really? Are you serious right now? I'm going on their date. <laughs> uh, sorry, I'm still getting dressed. This is so awkward. Oh my god. <laughs> How do I look? My friend helped me pick out this dress. She's got a great sense of... Who's your friend? Um, anyway, let's do this thing. Oh my god. Uh, hey, w wait! Actually, we still can't start the date here. Why not? Dating stop? Um, I've got to give you items to raise your affection statistic first. That'll increase the chance of a successful outcome to the date. Right? Anyway, don't worry, I'm prepared. 
I've been stockpiling gifts in anticipation for a date like this. But first, I've got some metal armor polish. Um, maybe you can't use that. I have Tammy armor, but I also brought some waterproof cream for your scales. I don't have that either. Your uh, scales. I'm not a fish. Uh, well, how about or reptile for that matter? This magical spear repair kit that I are these supposed to be all gifts for Undyne? Um. Hey, let's forget about the items. Let's just start the date. Dating, start. Yeah, let's, uh, date. This is so awkward. I can't do anything. Uh, do you like anime? <laughs> certain anime I like. Not all genres of anime, but certain anime, so I'll say yes. Hey, me too. Hey, let's go somewhere. But where's a good place to go on the date? I got it. Let's go to the garbage dump? Why? Why we go here? Here we are. This is where Undy and I come all the time. We find all sorts of great stuff here. Heh. <laughs> She's really... Uh... Oh no. That's her over there. I can't let her see me on a date with you. Why? Because, uh, well... Oh no, here she comes. You can jump in the trash can? Hey, there you are! Oh, shit! I just realized... I'm dying probably sending the word to come here to meet her. God damn it. Hey, there you are. I, uh, realized if you delivered that thing, it might be a bad idea. So I'm gonna do it. Give it to me. Oh, shit. Huh? You don't have it? Yeah. Have we, have we seen her? I don't know what to say. A lie. No, but she wasn't at home. Where the heck could she be? Please tell me the right thing to do. Oh my god. Well, I guess it's obvious, huh? I, uh, I really like her. I mean, more than I like other people. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just figured, you know, it'd be fun to go on like a cute kind of pretend date with you to make you feel better. What? Well, it sounds even worse when I put it like that. Yes, it does. I'm sorry, I messed up again. Undy's the person I, um, really want to go on a date with. But I mean, she's way out of my league. Don't say that. Not that you aren't, um, cool. But, but Undyne. She's so confident and strong and funny. And I'm just a nobody. Don't say that. A fraud. I'm the world scientist, but... All I've ever done is hurt. What? I told her so many lies, she thinks I'm... She thinks I'm a lot cooler than actually. What lies did you tell? If she gets close to me, she'll. She'll find out the truth of it. What truth? What should I do? Tell her the truth? The truth? But if I tell her that, she'll hate me. Is it better this way? To live a lie where both people are happy? Or truth where neither of us are? They say be yourself. But I don't really like my, who myself is. I'd rather just be whatever makes people like me. <laughs> no, you're right. Every day I'm scared. Scared that we'll, what will happen to people who are the truth on their own. They'll all get hurt because of me. But how can I tell Undyne the tr truth? I just don't have the confidence. I'm going to mess it up. How can I practice? Let's roleplay it. Roleplay? That actually sounds kind of fun. <laughs> okay, which of us will be Undyne? You should be. Me? Undyne? Uh, 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 okay. <laughs> I'll say what I think she'd say, and you, um, you show me what I'm supposed to do. Right, that makes sense. Yeah. Hey, Alphys, you look cute today. Which I say often, but platonically because I would never like you. No, I'm not gonna say you're what hot. Hi, Undyne, can we talk? Talk to you? Hmm, I guess so. I often seem excited to listen to you for some reason. I will make intent... intent eye contact with you so you sweat while you talk. So what is it? Let's tell them the truth. What? So you've been lying to me the whole time? Alphys, I can't believe you. You, you were for fine. How could you betray our friendship after how much I trusted you? Alphys, I will never love you. 
Never will you feel my passion and embrace. I, Undyne, will never kiss you with my beautiful... Oh, God, this game weird. What did you... J oh, shit. Uh, Undyne, I uh, was just... Hey, whoa, wait a second. Your outfit's really cute. What's the occasion? <laughs> wait a second. Are you two on a date? Uh, yes. I mean, uh, no. I mean, we were, but... I mean, actually, we were only romantically role-playing as you. What? I mean... I mean... Undyne, I... I've been lying to you. What? About what? About, well... Everything. I told you that seaweed is like scientifically important. I just use it to make ice cream. And those human history books I keep reading. Those are just dorky comic books. And the history movies. Those... Those are just, uh, anime. They aren't real. And that's how I told you I was busy with work on the phone. Was just eating frozen yogurt. Okay, okay. I, Jesus Christ, I can't read that quick. Alphys. I, I just wanted to impress you. I just wanted you to think I was smart and cool. That I wasn't some nerdy loser. Alphys. I'm dying. I, I really think you're in need, okay? Alphys. Shh. Shh. Don't kill her. Alphys. I, I think you're in need, too, I guess. Why did you dunk her in the trash? Well, you gotta realize, most of what you said really doesn't matter to me. I don't care if you're watching kid cartoons or reading history books. To me, all of that stuff is just nerdy crap. What I like about you is that you're passionate. You're an... Uh, an... an... analytical? It doesn't matter what it is. You care about it. 100% at maximum power. So you don't have to lie to me. I don't want you to have to lie to anyone anymore. Alphys, I want to help you because... You become happy with who you are. I know just the training you need to do that. Undying, you... You're gonna train me? <laughs> what? Me? Oh, God. Now, I'm gonna get Papyrus to do it. <laughs> get those bones shaken. It's time to jog 100 laps hooting about how great we are. Ready? I'm about to start the timer. Undying. I'll do my best. That was so... Oh my god. She was kidding, right? Those cartoons, those comics. Those are still real, right? No. Anime's real, right? No. Oh god, I don't know what to say! I should be the ch No, no! I can feel my heart breaking into pieces. No, I can survive this. <laughs> I have to be strong. For Alphys, thank you, human, for telling me the truth. I'll try my best to live in this world. See you later. Also, when I fell down here originally, who was the person that woke me up? I don't understand that. Do we find out in this pacifist ending? It said my name is, then it just went to blank. What did that say? Oh, okay. <clears throat> I get more astronaut food? Oh. Ring. Howdy. If it isn't my good friend who trusts me. This is Papyrus, your also mutual friend. Alphys and I finished our training early. That was quick. Very early. So I sent her home. Very home. Uh, now. I feel strongly, and for no apparent reason, you should also go there. To her, lab, house. I have only good feelings about this. Goodbye. Quick. Why do you want me to go there, Papyrus? Oh, what did you see on Dine's house? Is it still on fire? Yep, 100% on fire. Okay. <clears throat> Man, I don't even know how to describe this game at all. It's just so weird and trippy. But I like it. Hot land, and then we're off. I also didn't think there'd be fast travel like the fairy person, but... Uh-oh, suddenly feeling tropical. What? This person says the weirdest things.
Can we get some time yet, Charles? Oh, yes, yes, yes. Also, do I have to fight somebody else to get the true pacifist ending? I sure they're at the fort. Oh, it's a note. It's a note from Alfie's. Read it? Yeah, she probably wrote it for me. It's hard to read because of the handwriting, but you try your best. Hey, thanks for your help back there. You guys, your support really means a lot to me. But as difficult as it is to say this, you guys alone can't magically make my own problems go- What? I want to be a better person. I don't want to be afraid anymore. And for that to happen, I have to be able to face my own mistakes. I'm going to start doing that now. I want to be clear. This isn't anyone else's problem but mine. But if you don't ever hear from me again, if you want to know the truth, enter the door to the north of this note. You all at least deserve to know what I did. That's all she wrote. What the hell did you do, Alfie's? I'm... Oh my god. Looks like Metaton is undergoing repairs. Yes, I can see that. Well, so what the hell is with that door back in Snowden that had the mushrooms in front of it? I still don't know how to get in there, either. This wasn't a bathroom at all! I should have guessed. Warning, warning. Oh, wait, I'm losing power. M tether stability lost. What's M tether? Altitude dropping. Oh no. Might for that root plot twist like a folly. Where the hell are we? Actually, number one. This is it. Time to do what the king has asked me to do. I will create the power to free us all. I will unleash the power of the soul. Issue number two. The barrier is locked by soul power. Unfortunately, this power cannot be recreated artificially. Soul power can only be derived from what was once living. So to create more, we have, will have to use what we have now. The souls of mon- What? This game is so confusing. But extracting a soul from a living monster would require incredible power. Besides being impractical, doing so would instantly destroy the soul's host. And, unlike the persistent souls of humans, the souls of most monsters disappear immediately upon death. But when I can make a monster's soul last. Five? Where's entry number four? I've done it. Using the blueprints, I've extracted it from the human souls. I believe this is what gives their souls the strength to persist through death. The will to keep living, the resolve to change fate. Let's call this power... Determination. I'm lost again, guys. Close to the trippy music, I don't like it. True laboratory. The fake plant. I don't need no chips. What's this? Kids rock with that. Power room. No on the ground. You can't make it all out. Elevator. Lost power. Enter the center door. That's all you could read. Big plan. What is all this leaning towards? <clears throat> Number six. Asgore asked everyone out to side of the city from monsters that had fallen down. Their bodies came in today. They're still comatose, and soon they'll all turn into dust. What happens if I inject determination into them? If their souls persist after they perish, then... Freedom might be closer than we all thought. What the hell is going on? 9. Things aren't going well. None of the bodies have turned into dust, so I can't get the souls. I told the families that I would give them the dust back for the funerals. People are starting to ask me what's happening. What do I do? Kind of operating table, it's sticky. What the hell did you do, Alfie's? There's a note on the ground, you can't make it all out. Drain dropped it. That's all you can read. It's some kind of switch. There's a red colored slot in the center.
hell's going on? What the fuck is that? Something drew near. No data available. Oh, I don't want to look at this. WTF, guys. Nobody came. Okay. No, I can't spare them. Item? The enemy put a piece of itself in your inventory. What? Okay, at first I thought I could not get any weirder than the flower encounter, but they've just done it. Up and done it. What item they put in my inventory? Bad memory. Oh! Thanks a lot! Dicks. What's that? I didn't do anything. Am I supposed to fight these guys? I don't want to fight them. That might spoil the pacifist ending. Cell? Your voice is through the receiver. Come join the fun. What the f Fuck! Join? Then hold still, become one of us. It's a real get-together. We're supposed to not move during this segment? I don't know. Hold still, I won't move, I won't move. Alfie's do. More importantly, how do I beat this? I'm out of ideas here, guys. I don't want to attack these poor souls. Refuse. I am so trippy here. Oh. There's a red key lying in the sink. You took it and put it in your keychain. Quick, the red key gets perfectly into the slot. I gotta go back and save. I have no idea what the hell is going on, guys. No idea at all. Oh, this door is open now. number 12. Nothing is happening. I don't know what to do. I'll just keep injecting everything with determination. I want this to work. I think number 13. One of the bodies opened its eyes. It's an empty dog food bowl. It seems like a comfy bed. You could probably climb into it if you were to the left of it. Is that onion sound? Oh god. I don't think I should let it touch me. Not yet, not yet. Quack is broken. Actually, number 14. Everyone that had fallen down has woken up. They're all waking around talking like nothing is wrong. I thought they were goners. Right, we're about to approach 30 minutes. I have no idea how much longer this is, but I gotta stop it here. Cause I'm very perplexed. Plus, I need a drink. So, let's leave it here. I'll resume immediately after I get a drink, okay? So, thank you for watching. I will see you in the next video. Take care.